Hi everyone, uh, this is Tio speaking. I'm going to do a quick update today. I just wanted to give you guys here. Um, so, here I'm going to get straight to the point. Uh, I just got back from my vacation and I'm just kind of gathering everything right now. Uh, figuring out uh, all the things that we want to fix. And right now me, Pika, and Sparks, our, our main kind of core crew of execs at the moment, are in the process of putting together uh, mini plans to uh, improve the server on all levels. Uh, what we're going to start with first is we're going to start by uh, redeveloping our team. Uh, recently our team has taken kind of a hit between some people getting burnt out, um, some other people uh, getting demoted, so on and so forth. Uh, we are a little bit short staffed as we all know. So we're going to be expanding our team very soon and we're also going to be reorganizing our team in a way that should uh, increase our, efficienc uh, our efficiency significantly, allow us to get a lot more done. One of the big objectives that we're trying to reach, uh, someone actually mentioned uh, this in one of the comments in our last video, uh, one of our biggest objectives is to get to a point where players can uh, file a ticket and they can get help very quickly uh, no matter what time of the day that it is. That's one of the biggest objectives we're trying to reach with this. Um, and aside from that, we want to reach a point where we can regularly do the town tournament, do one big event every month, and do uh, a 1v1 tournament every weekend or at least something equivalent to that every weekend. Uh, so we should have all three of those things going smoothly. So uh, that's really uh, the objectives of this staff expansion. And on top of that, we also want to have a couple guys around uh, to take care of the tech department as well in the midst of all this. So uh, this is going to take some time, um, but you can expect to begin seeing the results of those improvements uh, probably within... Uh, the time frame of two to four weeks. That's when you can st expect to start seeing those results, all right? Now, uh, looking at the bigger picture. Now, we don't have details for this yet, uh, but in the next video we will. Uh, looking at the bigger picture, we're going to be making huge improvements over the next two months. As many of you guys know, we're still in beta. Our goal was to get out of beta by June. Unfortunately, we weren't able to achieve that goal, um, but we've realized that there's just a lot more on our plate and if we want to do this as well as we could do it then we're going to need more time so our goal now is to get out of beta sometime in august we don't have a specific date yet uh, we will begin promoting that date once it becomes available but that is the goal at this moment you're probably wondering what what will it look like for us to be out of beta uh, well, it's going to look like a lot of things. So the biggest thing is this. The server will be stable. We will not lag. Uh, there will be minimal lag even when uh, we have upwards of 50 players online. So that's the first thing. Uh, second thing, the residence plugin will work. Um, that plugin should actually be fixed. We need to uh, find some time to sit down and completely redo the shops from scratch. Uh, once that happens, I think the problem will be done with. Uh, but Anyway, uh, so that will be fixed, and so our economy will finally be able to flourish as it was intended. Aside from that, we will have mini games by that time. Uh, we are uh, beginning plans uh, for uh, what will be a mini games world that won't be available for a while now, but uh, the final product will include some mini games, and we'll continue to expand on those mini games after uh, the product is released. We will have our new spawn finished. Uh, we aim to finish that by about August, um, and uh, you know the new spawn. You know it's going to be a huge step up from our current one. It's going to have a lot more features. It's going to have uh, a lot more of all the good things you guys like. It's going to be a lot more explorable. There will also be warps to get you to the edge of spawn, so that you know if, if you just want to explore, you don't want to be in spawn, then you'll be able to warp uh, to the wild. Um, more details on that later but that would be part of the package as well and uh, the biggest thing is this the town tournament by then will be organized we'll have a full team ready to handle the town tournament um, we will have more resources available to promote the town tournament you'll be able to expect regular YouTube videos and not you know YouTube video here YouTube video there as there has been lately uh, that sort of thing so that's that's ultimately oh and sorry 
one last thing worth adding here. There will be more content. So we're talking uh, more plugins. A uh, few to mention off the top of my head would be uh, a good chance we'll have Movecraft. Not guaranteed. We did do some testing, and Movecraft is very, very taxing on performance. But we're going to try to optimize it and get it to a point where we can have Movecraft uh, without the lag associated with it. Um, aside from Movecraft, uh, you can expect that we'll have our Casino plugin fully up and developed by then, as well as our Cards plugin. You can expect that we'll have. Uh, more economy related plugins you can expect that we'll have um, literally double the amount of ranks that we have right now um, just a whole lot of different content uh, that we're aiming to put out there now again I can't I have no specific date as to when all this will be developed but that's what we're looking at as far as our, our final product um, and so you really you can expect a much more developed uh, form of Valcrest over the coming months. So uh, the game plan is this though. So the month of June we're going to spend reorganizing, developing a new staff, developing a better staff, a more efficient staff, and most of all a more organized staff. Um, so our objective is to get that done by the end of June. Going into July you can expect that the town tournament will resume. Uh, however, there won't be any big events in July. It will just be the town tournament. We'll also uh, plan on releasing those treasure hunts that were meant to be released on Origins Day. Those will be released sometime in July. Uh, finally, the big content you can expect to be released in August, at least at this time. And over the coming weeks, as these things become more and more certain, we'll, we might be able to get you an official date for that. But... Uh, as of now, uh, August is the generalized time that we're looking at for our, our final release. So anyway, thank you guys for your time. There's going to be more videos like this coming up uh, as June progresses and as we've made more progress. Uh, a lot of these plans that we're making right now are still in their infancy and a lot of them uh, need more development before we can give you guys the details. So anyway, thanks again and I'll talk to you guys next time.